beats a still drink, huh? I didn't know you drank. I thought it was strictly soda for you. Not like I never touched the stuff. Soda just agreed with the nanos better. <laughs> the nano machines break down alcohol before it has a chance to get you drunk. So, that explains it. No need to hold back anymore, huh? Yeah, well, it ain't all sunshine and rainbow. A lot of folks lost their entire sense of being the moment SOP went offline. You mean SOPS? I heard some people are going through withdrawals. SOP syndrome. Yep. SOP kept more than just alcohol under control. Those poor slobs are virtually naked now. What I hear, over 10% are showing symptoms. I guess getting rid of the Patriots won't solve all our problems overnight. You, uh, probably already suspected this, but I'm not actually an employee of AT Security. Uh huh? The Patriots raised me to be a gun locker. <laughs> the Patriots? My earliest memories are of the LRA. They kidnapped me, forced me to fight. Yep. Staring at a former child soldier. My parents, brothers, and sisters all killed in the war. Guess that makes me what you call a war orphan. After that, the Patriots picked me up and brought me into the family business. I was driven, number 893. There's a whole lot of pawns like me all over the world. How do you suppose I laundered guns like I did? <laughs> Cause they let me. In fact, I was under strict orders to back you guys from the start. You what? <sighs> hey man, don't take it personal. I wasn't the only one under their orders. Uh-huh. Probably never realized it themselves, but Rat Patrol Team Zero One. Voila. Patriot. Played like a violin. Obviously, Liquid's plot was a threat to the Patriots. So they planned to have you guys take care of me. Didn't turn out quite how they planned, though, did it? Yeah, well, I don't think they expected you to crash their system and wipe them out. So, does that mean you're out of a job now? <laughs> Are you kidding? I got the drip. All the Drebbins in the world are in on it. From now on, we're in business for ourselves. We are pawns no more. Easy there. The White House might have lost its taste for unilateralism, started to rebuild. But there's a lot of failed states out there that went bankrupt from their PMC habits. And they owe a shitload of money. Now, only question is, who's going to pick up the tab? I'm sure these new governments will try and keep it under control with PMC corporate reform laws, but it ain't going to be good enough. They all suck up to their eyeballs in the war economy. Might not be a new world order, but the old order under the war economy is gone for good. I'm guessing the U.N. is going to be more important than ever. What with multilateralism, you know. A certain president said it best back during the Cold War. 
For in the development of this organization rests the only true alternative to war. Then again, the UN itself is just an old 20th century relic. And if you think about it, when you look at its history, it ain't that different from the Patriots. Ah, uh, that's right. The nano machines used to keep you sober. Crush. Mix. Burn. Some time to rest. Mm -hmm. 